boys pipe up for Zoro. They say, hey, Zoro's not weak. Yeah, he's the strongest in our dojo. He's even stronger than the grown-ups. And then Queena just says, Dan So, well, he's not as strong as me. Even if he can use two swords, he's still weak. Losers should learn to suffer defeat in silence. Darn, Queena makes me so mad. She thinks she's so great just because she's the sensei's daughter. She's kind of cute, though, one of the boys says. And then now we see the sensei. He says, lost again, eh, Zoro? It's odd because you are actually very strong. And then the presumably students say, Sensei, Sensei, are you teaching her secret tricks because she's your daughter? It's not fair. Sensei says, of course not. And Zoro throws his two swords on the ground. He says, darn, why can't I beat that girl? And Sensei says, don't forget that Queena is a little older than you. And then Zoro says, but I can beat grown-ups. I'm going to sail the seas and become the greatest sword master in the world. I can't keep losing to that girl. Clack, clack, clack. Queena is training in the night. She sees Zoro approaching and says, Zoro. Queena, I challenge you to a duel with real swords. You're not afraid of real swords, are you? Real swords. Okay. It's your funeral. And she accepts. Now they're fighting. Zoro says, on guard. And she says, I'm ready. And they're fighting in the middle of the night under the moon. It's very dramatic. They jump towards each other. Yeah. Says, come, come, hurrah! 
rocket and he flies launching himself out of the window and Captain Morgan yells fire and the Marines take aim and we see Luffy jump in right in the nick of time and he takes all the bullets that were shot at Kobe and Zoro and Zoro just in shock says you and Kobe says Luffy Captain Morgan responds straw hat and the Marines are just watching in shock they're so confused and then we can see the bullets making Luffy's body stretch as they elongate into his skin and Luffy just shoots them back ricochet style and says bullets can't hurt me and as the bullets go flying everywhere he says look out well not him but probably the marines it's not clear and captain morgan has a really funny reaction on his face because he was not expecting that and luffy just laughs ha, 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 ha. and zoro says what are you and luffy says i'm the guy who's gonna be the king of the pirates so which swords are yours i didn't know so i brought all three and zoro says they're all mine I practice Sun Poor you three sword style. If you fight the navy with me here and now, in the eyes of the government, you'll be the bad guy, says Luffy. And then he says, Of course you could obey the law and let them kill you. And Zoro just responds, You must be demon spawn, but I'm not ready to die without a fight. Alright, you've got yourself a pirate. And that's the end of chapter 5.